Welcome back to Our Cabin Escape. Um, this weekend, what we're looking at is, is we've got to finish hanging the TJIs and the rest of our subfloor. So we've got five more of those to hang and a couple small ones in the stairwell. So um, from there... Maybe start on an upstairs wall. <laughs> We'll, we'll see what we get done this weekend. It is supposed to rain Saturday, so... And this is Friday, so we should have all today to do it. Um, and part of tomorrow, hopefully. So, we'll see what we can get done. Um, yeah, we're just excited to be up here and just seeing progress, so, yep. So, stick with us. Here we go. except for the very last one set. Uh, set some of the uh, one row of the subfloor. We got all of the joist hangers for the short section that will go uh, below the front door set. And then we have Dave over here. Dave right here is going to cut these short pieces of TJI for us to set into place. So, we are just getting ready to set the huh? last TJI. So, Dave is up there on top, measuring between every one of the J bolts, because this last TJI, TJI has to be notched to sit over the top of every one of those J bolts. So, we'll get it cut and notched. And then we'll be back and I'll show you as we set it in place. Dave is just gluing and getting ready to set the final piece of our floor into place. We're super excited. Done with floors, moving on to walls. Now it'll look like we did something every day. Now that you can see we've finished the entire floor, anybody who has ever built a house, <clears throat> which isn't me, <laughs> knows that OSB plywood, or OSB, has a strength axis, which runs the length, or the eight foot section, of your piece of OSB. Well, I saw this, it actually tells you this, Right there. 
but the strength axis runs this direction. Well, I took this to mean that it needed the strength in that direction. So I laid it down and started running this parallel to our joists. That is incorrect and does not meet code. Um, I realized this when I was looking up something else completely separate this week in relationship to a code and I had this aha moment of, oh crap, um, it's going the wrong way. It should be going perpendicular to your joists. So, after freaking out for <laughs> quite some time, I finally just called the inspector for the county and I asked him, can we just lay another, you know, layer of sub four over the top of it, going the correct direction? He says, absolutely, go for it. Just make sure you use longer nails and make sure they go into your TJIs as well. So, now that we've laid all of this beautiful, beautiful flooring, we're going to lay a second layer on top of it. This is probably a thousand dollar mistake on my part because I didn't bother to research something that I absolutely should have. So here we go, we're gonna do this again. So here we are, it's actually the end of the day. This took us far longer than we anticipated it was going to take, um, but it is all done. So yay, we can finally start on walls. I know we keep saying that. I think we're actually gonna do it tomorrow morning. Um, so I don't know as we got any actual time lapse of this, just because I think the camera died early on. But here it is. So all of the flooring is in. We now have two layers. It is a very, very solid floor. We're kind of excited for it. So it's all done and in. And yeah, there you go. So if all goes well tomorrow morning, we will actually take and start framing this east wall. Here's what we've got. We've got the first of the wall fully done. But with the wind that we're currently having yet again, we're not going to stand it up right now. It's just built. Um, we'll start getting this next wall prepped and ready to go. And yeah, we'll just kind of go from there. If we don't get them stood up, we'll come back next weekend and we'll stand them up. So yeah, just stay tuned and watch the progress.
right, that's it. it for us for this weekend. We are about to get rained on, so we're gonna wrap things up and just hang out and enjoy the area for the weekend. So we did get two walls done, fully framed, um, ready to go. Just with the wind and the rain coming in, we didn't get anything stood up. So um, yeah, they are done. So next weekend when we start, we just have walls to start and then we'll just continue to frame from there. Um, so yeah, that's kind of it. Now we just got a little clean up. And... So thanks for watching. Yep. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Yep. We'll see you next time.